The FuelTech FT700 is the next step of evolution on engine management systems. We imagine what we should be able to do and we actually built the harder to do it. So as we just start doing the pre-order of the unit, we actually been collecting some questions through social media, through people that we spoke with and PRI, and now I'm gonna answer some of them, okay? I'm Luis De Leon from FuelTech USA, so come with me as I go through those questions and I hope I can answer most of them. Okay, let's start. Why Vision FT? That's a pretty good question. We'll start with a good one. So Vision FT is actually the new product line. The FT700 is actually the first unit. We will have the regular version, FT700, and the FT700 Plus that has all the same features, but it has like a screen that's pretty much twice the size, right? We built this new generation, the Vision FT, because our previous generation or actual generation, the Power FT, it's been there for some time. So the hardware is getting close to its limit, right? So we want to do more, but the hardware is limiting us. So what we do, Vision FT, FT700. What is the FT700 Founders Edition? That's not a good one, okay, I like it. The 700 Founders Edition is the first batch of the FT700. It's exclusive. You can only get it through the pre-order. And it has some cool stuff. So because the first batch is limited, because it's limited, it's actually numbered. So you will have engraved on the unit the number that you have. You will have some other small customizations, right? But in the end, is how exclusive is the unit to be able to get the first one and to be able to get something that's one of a kind. Can you easily change your 450, 550 or 600 to the 700 with your existing harness? Yes, you can. So the 700 has a bunch of connectors on the back, but the two on the bottom, they're the most important ones. They're the A and B. They are exactly the same as the 600. No joke, it's the same. So if you have a 600 in your car, you literally will have to unhook the 600, hook the 700, connect your laptop, do the wizard to convert the tune and go down the road. You don't have to change anything on your harness. If you do a 450 or 550, then it will have a small adapter. But the deal is this, it's the same family. It's not the same connector, it's the same family. You can actually just repin and connect your harness that you have on a 450, 550, straight to a 700. Everything that's extra that the 700 has are extra connectors. So you need to add to your harness, but not replace if you already have a Power FT ECU on your car. Will my FT600 be updated to have the same software as the 700? Unfortunately not. The 700 has a new generation of hardware, the Vision FT, and it simply cannot do it. Think about your cell phone, think about your computer or even your TV. When you get five, six, seven years of new hardware development, sometimes it's just not compatible. But this is the deal. The 600, the 550, and the 450, they still be out. They still can do everything they've been doing today. And we actually plan to have a couple updates before we stop and focus on this one. How many tunes can I have it now? Well, this, this is a big deal. The 700 has 64 gigs of memory. That's a ton, okay? Um, we're talking about of unknown amount of tunes and logs that you can run because obviously the logs will be maybe 20 seconds maybe two hours so that will change right but as today you will be able to have as many tunes as you want and even if you race 
endurance race, this 24 hour race, you'll be able to log the whole race. So plenty of memory. And you know what is the coolest thing also? The unit has two USB ports, one on the front. You guys can see I'm powering this unit through the front one. And it has one on the back. You actually can hook up a flash drive to the unit to expand the memory. So if by any reason you want to have even more memory than that, it's easy for you. You connect, boom, you expand the memory. So plenty tunes, plenty locks. When will Vision FT software be available? Hmm, we all waiting for it, right? So I'm, I'm anxious. I want to show to you guys how it is, but we're doing some small touch-ups and we plan to do this August. So this video recording early July. So in about a month or so, early August, you guys will be able to download the software. And just like what we have on the other softwares for free, you can go out there and check it out. See what we have, right? And see how the new software has a bunch of cool stuff. What is the benefit of wireless communication? Okay, so as we spoke about it, the unit has wired connection, USB-C, USB-C, right? But what if you didn't have to connect to connect on your cell phone? Yeah, so the unit now has built-in Bluetooth and Wi-Fi, right? So depends on the situation, one is quicker, one is longer distance, but the deal is this, the unit has 1024-bit encryption, so it's safe and you can actually connect up to three devices at the same time. So you could be racing a race car and as you get to a pit stop, one of your crew members can be on the cell phone instantly, checking what's going on, downloading a log or something like that. If you're doing drag racing, after a run, as the car gets to the pit, it can be connected to your race car laptop and already downloading a log. So it streams like the process, make everything easier, right? Everything is easier, quicker. Is the 700 waterproof? Yes. So just like the 450, 550, 600, it's IP67 rated. What does that mean? You can actually submerge into the water about three feet for like 30 minutes and the unit will not allow any water to get in is also dust proof. So if you're gonna do some boat racing, jet ski racing, ATV in the middle of the desert, the unit will be water and dust proof, right? But just remember, don't pressure wash the unit, right? But you'll be fine with any kind of rain or splashes of water, you know, or dust or mud. If you do off-roading, you'll be fine. What about diesel? Not control, V and custom functions. So this is actually pretty cool. Because we built such a more advanced hardware, we actually able to put more features. The Vision FT, the 700, will have everything that we have on the Power FT line, but more, right? So the unit will have volumetric efficiency. It will have custom features where you can actually design your own specific features, right? And some features we will release down the road as we have a little bit more time to test, make sure everything is okay. You will see 700 using knock control, diesel, and some other stuff that actually is pretty exciting, right? The unit has eight inputs at really high speed. We talk about 400 kilohertz that in the future we want to do um, in-chamber pressure control. So those are features for, you know, for the feature as we update the unit, just like how we did on the Power FT line. Will the 700 be compatible with all fuel tech components? Yes. So if you already have a FT input expander, a Nano Pro, a Pick and Hold Pro, yes, you can. Oh, but I have a Nano Pro, but the unit now has 202s built in. It's up to you. You can repin the probes to your 700, or you can leave your nano probes on the car and you still use as a secondary dash or secondary uh, 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 switch panel. It's, it's up to you, no big deal. You can choose what you wanna do. What is the FT cloud? That's actually pretty cool. This is actually pretty cool. 
FT Cloud, it's a cloud online system, right? Where as being a service, you can, if you choose to engage, constantly keep your data into the cloud. So imagine this, as you connect to your ECU, like you, you get to the pit and you get into your internet connection, the unit can go online and update your tunes and your logs to your cloud storage. So now, besides having 64 gigs here and allowing you to have another flash drive to connect and have more memory, we, you literally talk about unlimited data. You go out there and now you're in a cloud service. You can put as many tunes and logs as you want, right? So the cloud service, it's also something that will get updates down the road. We intend to do some advanced data analysis through AI on the cloud system. But again, this is down the road as we update the system. But that cloud system is gonna be a game changer. Why should I pre-order? I listen to this sometimes, and I'm gonna tell you this. Pre-ordering gets you in the front of the line. You will be able to get a 700 before. Our idea to deliver the first batch, and remember, it's a limited batch. It's early October. Once we finish this, we're still gonna have 700 going on, but we don't know when is gonna be the next batch. So for the following batch, we don't know the date yet. It may be November, December, January. We don't know the date. But for the first batch, for the pre-order, it is October. Early October, we start dispatching the units out there. So if you have a car that you intend to do an update through the winter time, if you're building a new car for the next season, if you want to make sure that you have the latest and greatest as soon as it's available, and if you want some perks, the first unit, the Founders Edition, can only be ordered through the pre-order. Once the pre-order is gone, there's no Founders Edition. But remember, the Founders Edition has extended warranty. So you receive more warranty, three years. The unit includes cloud service. So the cloud service that's gonna be a paid service is included in the pre-order, one year of cloud service. We will have a exclusive concierge style tech support for the Founders Edition. So if you buy a unit from the pre-order, you will have a closer contact with the best tech support in the industry. And we have some exclusive gifts that I cannot say because it's a surprise. And those gifts are exclusive to pre-ordering a Founders Edition. So, um, I would recommend, if you're interested in the 700, think about the pre-order. It's a pretty good one. Uh, we should have the software uh, early August on about 30 days from what we're releasing this video. And um, we're gonna try to answer more questions as you guys do the questions, but stay put. We're gonna be doing more, more and more material for you guys to stay uh, up to date with the 700 and what we've been doing with it. And we all excited to see it. And I, I hope in not long, I can even race my personal race car for 700. So we, we're getting close, guys. We're getting close. So watch our, our social media. Stay on top of our YouTube channel, Facebook, Instagram. We're going to be sharing more stuff. And if you still have questions, put it out there. And we're going to do more videos about, you know, frequently asked questions. Okay? So... See you guys next time.